the great debate that's going on coast to coast today over Kim Kardashian's pregnancy fashion. What do you think? Is it awful or awesome? Kim pregnancy fashion hits and misses have people divided everywhere, all over the planet. The body hugging leather, the revealing gowns, the three inch heels, and she's really pregnant. With me tonight from Hollywood fashion expert and TV personality Nikki Penny, who once worked as the stylist to yet another famous mom to be, Kate Middleton. Nikki blogs on the BritishBardot.com. And Mary Alice Stevenson with us from Washington tonight. She is a beauty expert and she has styled everybody from Beyonce to JLo. Great having you both here. Let's get right into it and start by taking a look at one of Kim's most talked about pregnancy outfits so far. Some have called it egregious when she wore the skin-tight black leather skirt, sleeveless white blouse, and a first stole. She was out running errands while she was wearing all that. So to our countdown question, awful or awesome? And Mary Alice, I begin with you. Well, AJ, I'm going to say that Kim is awesome in general. I think that a lot of times the media um, amps up everything she wears and actually picks pictures that uh, make her look a lot bigger than she is. Um, this one from the side, many of the, the, the images are manipulated by media. TMZ does this a lot. So in fine print, it'll say that this image was manipulated. But Kim's <laughs> only gained about 20 pounds, AJ. She's five foot two. The average height of a woman in America is five foot four. She's five foot two. She's extremely curvy. Let's all embrace her for her love of fashion and her love of curves. Mary Alice, I am right there with you. I've been saying it all along, and I'm not one to normally defend <laughs> Kim Kardashian, but I, I think it's unfair that people have been taking shots at her for what she's wearing. She took a lot of heat for that leather look, but she talked about it on Live with Kelly and Michael, and you got to see what she said. Okay. Like, I wore this black leather skirt the other day. It looked people, adorable. Thank you. I loved it. People are like, why are you wearing black? Are you ashamed? Are you trying to hide it? And I was, I, it was tight. I was trying to show the bump. Right. And, um, you know, you're suffocating the baby. And I'm like, wait, <laughs> I had this skirt, like a maternity skirt made for me, like, especially. And Nikki, she went on to say that she felt good about herself, but do you agree with Kim or the critics? Awful or awesome for you? I think it's awful, AJ. I'm really sorry, but I think she, Kim has made her name very cleverly on gaining press attention. That's what her whole career is based upon. And she's clearly very cleverly doing it with her dress sense, too, because it's so awful. What's wrong I mean, with it? She why? Can't... Why? I it's... have a question, AJ. Okay, Nikki, have you ever been pregnant? No, I haven't. Right. So Not yet, in the debate, no. like, you need, we need to have a woman here that understands your body changes, you gain weight. That is healthy. What I, I remember you saying a lot in the press about how you were so, so passionate and pleased that Kate Middleton stayed true to who she was in her preg with her pregnancy style. That's exactly what Kim is doing. Kim became famous globally because she loves fashion. She started as a stylist. And she also has curves. That's why the world responds to her. To say it's awful is doing a huge disservice to women across the entire globe. I understand what you're saying, Mary Alice, but I actually think that all, I have so many friends that are pregnant right now, and they are very sexy and curvy and very fashion forward, just like Kim, but they dress in the right way. Everything she wears emphasizes her bump in the wrong way. I appreciate that she's sexy and she's a woman and she likes to be, you know, cool and fashion forward, but she just picks all the wrong things. Well, I actually think... If you think, think she looks great every time she steps out the house... I don't think any woman uh, you know. looks great every time they step out the house. <laughs> and I think that most first-time moms um, are just easing into... Um, their curves, their body is changing so dramatically. They have hits and misses just like everybody else. Well, let, let me know? see if I can get you two on the same page with another look. <laughs> let, let's, let's continue the debate, but I want to look at the Michael Landman dress that Kim wore when she was on live with Michael and, uh, Kelly and Michael. This even set off a huge online fashion yeah. debate, people either loving it or hating it. Nikki, was this any better for you, awful or awesome? I loved the color of it. The color of it was really chic and demure, but the way that the, the dress comes out, it's almost as if she's going to lift off like a hot air balloon. <laughs> 
Oh, that's so funny. Well, Mary Ellis, uh, you know I'd love what? to hear what you have to say about I, it because she I, clearly loves to show off her assets with, you know, the really body hugging ensembles. Awful or awesome you know for you in that outfit. AJ, that's I think that that's fine and that's okay. You know, she loves fat. That's what fashion is all about, showing off and being pregnant is something that you should show off and and Kim feels comfortable in her own skin. She feels sexy. You know, I've had a lot of conversations with Kim's camp. It, you know, she do, it does hurt her feelings when people like Nikki um, say she doesn't look good. She's trying like everybody else. This dress is Albert Albez for Lanvin. Um, uh, Kim has been working with a lot of different designers like Albert Albez, like Ricard Ricardo Tichy from Givenchy. She's had her friends that are designers like Rachel Roy work with her to design clothing that, that you know, fits her the right way. I just wish that people would give this, you know, girl a break and just accept her and her curves. And that's the very thing why everyone loves her to begin with. And, and, a and, and listen, I'm, I'm getting an education, too, because now I know it's <laughs> Levant. Listen, to your point, Mary Alice, I want to break down Kim's high fashion pregnancy style now. Okay. Look at these outfits. She wore this long white gown, glammed up for the Elton John AIDS Foundation event around the Oscars. She looks beautiful, uh, uh, I think. N Nikki, is this not the look you would expect from a fashionista? Awful or awesome on this one? Well, I just don't know why she went for the color white, because white, you have to have a certain physique to wear anyway, because it's such a tricky color. And if she wore this in black, I think it would have been awesome. But because of the color with her bump and everything and her figure, I just think it was all kinds of wrong. All right, well. See, I, th I think, AJ, it's all kinds of right that it's angelic. Being pregnant is, uh, you know, angelic and a beautiful thing. I think she looks gorgeous. I think there are no rules in fashion right now. It's about breaking rules, and I love this dress. 